Okay, <clears throat> well, I think the neighbor's done running the chainsaw now, so maybe we can talk a little bit. Uh, I just wanted to show my, uh, over the weekend I was out at the camper, and I had a, uh, I was cruising marketplace like I always do, playing around, and I uh, seen this combo for a reasonable price. I think it was $25 she wanted for the pair. And it's a, a 220F lantern, I think, in very good shape. Doesn't look like it was used much at all. Uh, check valve was gummed up in it and stuff. I had to clean it and stuff, but other than that, it runs perfectly now. And a 420 something stove and it's, it's in pretty decent shape too it's got a wee little bit of uh, rust in the, not rust but uh, tarnish in the pan at the bottom but other than that it's in nice shape too and same thing uh, the check valves good thing I bought that tool that uh, Robert suggested so we got them all fired up and ready to go now. And uh, while I was out there, the guy said, uh, I got an old porcelain coffee pot. It was, I believe it was my grandmother's. Uh, he said, would you like to have it too? And I said, sure. You know, so he threw that in the deal. And it's one of the, it's, a, it's an older porcelain pot. It's one of the few I've seen recently it still had the uh, porcelain basket and stuff in it, so I figured I'd give it a, give it a try and uh, make a cup of coffee and uh, see how she works. So let's pour a cup and see what she tastes like. Oh yeah, one other thing. Also, in the deal, although it's not Coleman, it's from uh, the Lantern, Lantern Caddy Company, Salt Lake City. So, uh, that's pretty nice. It's got a little indentation in the bottom where the uh, lantern sets in, and then the nut for the vent comes through the top, and you screw it on to hold the lid on and stuff, and pretty nice. I looked inside and there's two packs of mantles, a new generator, a wrench, and a funnel. So I didn't think I could go wrong for the price. So like I say they're not neither of them's real rare items but uh, they're in nice shape and they're nice usable items anyway. So uh, Let's get that cup of coffee in. Sure looks like coffee. It even tastes like coffee. So, that's about it. I just wanted to kind of show off the, uh, my weekly find. Got a couple more projects sitting here on the floor. Another stove and a catalytic heater that I picked up out of the $5 pile down at the uh, thrift store. 
so uh, so I don't want to run out of things to work on. But uh, that's about it. In the beginning of this video, I did show uh, a little box that I made up to uh, put my uh, tool for removing the uh, uh, check valves with and stuff. Uh, it's came. It's it's already paid for itself like four times. So I'm glad I got that. Um, other than that, that, that's about it. Uh, I'll dedicate this one to to uh, Steve and Rob, and all of them that uh, kind of got me involved in this. Shall we say hobby? And, uh, hopefully, I won't get carried away with this one. Until next time. Be kind to one another. Catch you all later.